This is an open challenge to all creationists who happen on this video. And if you're an atheist or an agnostic or yada yada yada, pass it on to a creationist you know. And let them hear what I've got to say. Because I'm being dead serious here. I'm not going to make fun of you. I'm not going to do anything that's going to attack you. I want to ask one simple question. Just one. First, I'm going to get to, to I'm going to explain, and I'm going to get to the question. So, here we go. Okay. So, your pet theory on how we've come to be, and so on and so forth, comes from Genesis, obviously. And you say that human beings are not animals. We are not apes. We are above animals, correct? That's correct. I'm sure that's how you think. I've dealt with enough creationists to see that is a common common trait in all of creationists. Now, the question. If we are not animals, if we are not apes, we must fall under some other classification. Correct. You would classify us as what? Science? classifies us as mammals. Last I checked, mammals are animals. Explain away that. I mean, you can sit here and explain away all the vestigial limbs and appendages and organs and so on and so forth by your own little, well, it could be for this or it could be for that or it could have never done the so on and so forth with your rambling on. But it's fine. I want you to explain away how mammals cannot be animals. And then if you say human beings are mammals, but they're not animals, how, how about a cat or a dog or a cow or a muskrat? I mean, come on. Those aren't animals. They're mammals. Explain to me how mammals are not animals. Human beings are animals. Plain and simple. Your Bible, your pet theory on how we've come to be, says we're not animals. That we're special. The only thing that makes us, the human being, more special than any other mammal on the planet is sentience. That's it. If you want to call it made in God's image or have a spirit or soul or whatever, and that makes you feel better, okay, just don't bring that bullshit to the table. Keep it to yourself because that's what it's meant for. Don't try and put it into schools. Don't try to make it a mandatory curriculum. Keep it to yourself. It's not fact. It's your opinion. Anyway, I've gone way beyond the question. Why do you insist that human beings are not animals? When we are. Thank you. Somebody get this freaking duck away from me!